Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today we'll be reviewing tips for replacing spark plugs on a 2014 Toyota Corolla S with the 1.8 liter engine. If you haven't done so already, please check out my video, Secrets to Planning and Auto Repair. As an added bonus today, what I'd like you to do is go in your vehicle right now, turn on your ignition, and record the cruising range, the estimated cruising range. After the repair, I'd like you to go back again, take another picture of the estimated cruising range. Using the starting and ending values, you should be able to determine the immediate savings that you'll be getting by changing your spark plugs. Now let's get started. You might ask, what are some of the most common signs of bad spark plugs? Well, you might have trouble starting the vehicle, rough idling, sluggish acceleration, declining fuel economy, engine misfiring, and engine knocking. Let's quickly go over our supply list. Today I'm recommending the Denso Iridium TT spark plug, very high performing spark plug. Um, we'll have some dielectric grease, ignition coils for vehicles over 150,000 miles. We're gonna be using a 3 8 inch ratchet, a 10 inch extension bar, a 10 millimeter socket, a spark plug socket, and other items found in the description below. Okay. First, we'll want to disconnect the neg negative battery terminal, which is notated by, usually there's a black cable, and then there's a minus sign on the battery. Then we're gonna go ahead and move the engine cover, like that. And so what you have in front of you are the four spark plug coils. One, two, three, and four. For demonstration purposes today, I will be showing how to remove the spark plug coil, electronic connector, and the retaining bolt right here. Okay, using our 10 millimeter socket, let's remove this bolt right here. We're gonna undo this clip. And we're gonna remove our coil pack. When we remove our coil pack, the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna inspect it. This is the dust cover. Right here is a spring inside. We want to make sure that there's no rust inside of there. That looks in really good condition. The dust cover clips are in good place. This has been inspected and ready to go. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and remove the spark plug. Okay, here we go. This is the current condition of the spark plug. It's not in too bad a shape. Um, it would function fine, except for, you know, you're not gonna get the mileage you're looking for. So let's go ahead and replace the spark plug. Let's go ahead and reinstall our pre-inspected coil pack. Our 10 millimeter bolt. You always wanna start your bolts by hand, never using a power tool. It doesn't take much. I just want to make it snug. There you go. Then you're going to attach your 
electronic clip. Now one of the key ways of knowing that the clip is properly attached is to listen for the click sound. There you go. Now, if I were to replace the remaining plugs at this location, this location, this location, you would follow the exact same procedure and um, that, that pretty much wraps it up. After that, you just want to put on your engine cover and then don't forget to reattach your negative battery terminal. Well folks, that just about wraps up the tips on how to replace spark plugs on this 2014 Corolla S with a 1.8 liter engine. I hope you found my tips to be helpful. If so, please like and subscribe. And until next time, drive defensively.